Hey everybody, welcome to the channel. My name is Ten Vince. Quick how-to video for you here. Uh, if you're like me, and probably many people, your game suffers from a lot of game lag. And the game lag is from uh, a number of different sources, but I want to talk about one of the major sources of game lag, and that is your mobile creations here. Now I am on um, what I am calling uh, the pooper scooper or well I haven't really named it yet but anyways this is a big creation I've recently made it's for mining and it's really big and it's really heavy and yeah it saps my frames I have it on this jack stand right here not jack stand it's a uh, it's on a pedestal it's on a it's on a thing connected to the ground and that is how I save my frames now watch if I take this off well, notice how my frames right now, well, you can't see maybe, but 120, 121, 119 FPS, it's like that. It's steady. I have an FPS limiter. It limits it to 120. Take this off. It crashes to the ground, and immediately I'm sunk down to the normal 25, 30 FPS that happens when I'm around this vehicle all the time. And driving it, it doesn't get any better. It's, it's pretty bad driving it. I'm running now 16 FPS, 15 FPS. It's pretty bad. So that is my best tip for uh, reducing the lag, bringing up the FPS in your game. When you have these around big heavy creations, what you got to do when you're not using them is just make a little stand for them. For, for that barely does it for me, what I'm gonna do is take my jack, I'm gonna get under here. This one's a bit low to the ground, but there we go. Just jack it up a little bit like that. Give me a weld point like that and put it on its stand uh, just like that. And boom, 40 frames a second, immediately back up to 120 frames per second. That's how you do it. Save your FPS by putting your heavy creations on a stand when you're not using them. When you do find your weld point and you stick it on your stand, do be sure that the wheels aren't touching the ground because that will definitely give you the best results. Now, a lot of that is because of the weight. You can have a big creation, but as long as it's light, it'll probably be fine. Yeah, so it's basically the weight of the vehicle that, uh, that kills you. I did some testing and I took off this big heavy stuff here in the back. And uh, it did help a lot. I mean, I'm running 20 frames a second uh, still right now, actually. That's, and when I took these off, I was running 50 to 60. So uh, you know, I relieved, I relieved a good bit of weight there, and I still got a lot of frames. But overall, it's still a pretty heavy thing. And this thing calculating massive weight on a suspension is partially what uh, what is sapping your frame rate. So. I'll show you right now, I recorded this before, I took all the suspension off and I put wooden blocks in there, removing the suspension and it made a significant improvement. Sorry it's night, but as you can see I've taken all the springs out of here and I've filled them all in with wooden blocks. So this thing has now no suspension, it's just got wooden blocks and I seem to be running about uh, yes, 80, 90, sometimes it dips down, yeah a bit. Um, oh, got a hundred there. But yeah, it's generally a lot better than usual. Uh, sig significantly better than usual. So, <laughs> if you can, just uh, don't have suspension if you need all the weight. Alright guys, so there are a few things you can do to save your um, frame rate there. You can reduce the weight of your car. You can see if it's viable taking the suspension off if you can't reduce the weight of the car. Uh, those things will help you. But overall, mm, the best the best way to do it, uh, when you're not using it at least, is to just make a small stand for it and weld it onto the top because that's what's doing it. It's your really heavy vehicles on suspension. And if you have a slope, if there aren't a slope, that makes it even worse. So anyways, if you found the video helpful, do spank that like button in the booty for me. I appreciate that very much and I'll see you in my next video. Goodbye.